The OCS Smart can be configured to have automatic opening, specific rental times, automatic closing, and expiration dates. These features depend on if the lock is configured to be a free type lock or dedicated type lock. When the OCS Smart is in free mode, you can set the lock to have automatic opening or a rental time frame. Both cannot be active at the same time. Tap Automatic Opening and a clock will appear, allowing you to drag the clock arm to configure the hour and the minute you want the lock to open. This clock is a 24-hour clock, with the outer circle of numbers being AM and the inside circle of numbers being PM. Choose a time for the lock to open automatically. Next, choose what days of the week this automatic opening time will apply to. In this example, the lock will open at 4.30 p.m. Monday through Friday. When you have set up your automatic opening times, rental time will be grayed out. If you want to delete the setting you created, tap Automatic Opening again and it will ask if you are sure you want to delete it. Tap Yes to delete the setting. Tapping Rental Time will allow you to set up the duration of time the OCS Smart will be locked for. Once again, the clock will appear, but this time it works as a 24-hour timer instead of a 24-hour clock. The timer can be a minimum of one hour to a maximum of 23 hours and 59 minutes. The timer begins when the user locks their OCS Smart with the user app. In this example, the lock will be closed for five hours before it automatically opens. If the user opens the lock before the timer expires and closes the lock again, the countdown will be reset, giving the user another five hours. As you can see, automatic opening is grayed out when rental time is active. To clear the rental timer, tap Rental Time again, and it will already be set to zero. Tap OK to clear. When the OCS Smart is in dedicated mode, you can set up the lock to have automatic closing. We strongly recommend using this feature only if you have a slam latch style back to prevent damage to your locks and lockers. The expiry of dedicated option allows you to set up how long the locks can be used by the same person. A calendar will appear, allowing you to pick the day the lock will expire and the exact time. In this example, it will expire on August 26, 2021 at 5 p.m. If the user does not open the lock by 5 p.m., they will receive an error message and will not be able to retrieve their items. A facility manager with the master code will need to open the locker for them. Thank you for watching, and if you need further assistance, please contact us.